Hey guys, welcome back to Let's Play Pokemon Platinum. Okay, you may notice right now uh, in the sidebar, Eevee's name has changed. So, off screen, I went back to Eternal City and changed this thing's name. If it gives away the evolution, I'm sorry, but I just didn't want to leave it to the part where I actually evolve it. So, yeah, if you don't, if you don't realize what I'm going to evolve it into, then please don't look into it because it'll just ruin the surprise. And if you do get it, then whoop de doo I guess. <laughs> also, off-screen, I bought, like, um, loads of Super Repels because they're available to buy now. Also, bought, like, a couple of Super Potions, Antidotes, and all that kind of stuff. I'll, I'll be saving these Rare Candies for later on when I need them. Then my Pokemon are, like, away from, um, just, like, a couple levels away from evolving. I'll use them then. Um, so this route uh, is uh, just a little connecting route that is uh, connects you to Celestion Town, but it's just full of trainers and just a couple items. So I'm just gonna speed the whole thing up like I usually do. So see you guys in a couple seconds, minutes, I guess. So enjoy the music. I'm not sure what I'm gonna pick, but enjoy it.
Okay, so we finally finished the whole route, and we are finally in Salacion Town. And when we enter Salacion Town, we meet Barry again. Yahoo! Hey, I got something cool. I'll show you as a special favor. Huh? What the? What's this all about? I got some seals, but I forgot to put them on. Alright, because it's... You have to go to the... He gives you a little hint that we go to the Salacion Ruins to get the hidden move Defog. The little uh, tower you see here will be going there soon. We need defog for that, so we'll be doing that soon. Okay, so we are in Salacian Town. Only a couple things are significant here. Um, Pokemon Daycare, if you leave your Pokemon here, they'll raise it for you. And if they're compatible in breeding, they will make an egg, and this guy will give you the eggs. If you actually have one. So, and other than the Pokemon Center, these people... If you go talk to them and they'll give you a random Pokemon every day and if you bring them that Pokemon they'll give you some kind of rewards Shellos and we already have a Shellos how amazing yeah he gives you heart scale and um, yeah he gives you a heart scale and a couple Pokeballs which is really lucky I guess so we get a cub great balls and heart scale which is really great because heart scales are really rare in the game so yeah, they do this every day, so if you go to them tomorrow, they will have another random Pokemon, and sometimes they're really... I think they depend on the Pokemon you've seen, but I could be wrong, so I'm not sure about that. But I'm pretty sure it's only depending on the Pokemon you've seen, caught, so, um, yeah. So if you've seen them, you should be able to have a way to catch them. Alright, so... Uh, in the, if you didn't notice in the fast forward, uh, we got the good rod, which is uh, just a better version of the old rod, and we also, I also taught my Gligar Earthquake with the TM we got from Wayward Cave. All right, we'll be getting those items in a bit, but I really, before I end off, I really need to get this over with, uh, real quick. I'm gonna throw up a repel because you get all Pokemon here, and if you come here, um, this is all written in unknown, unknown, so it says top right. Lower left, top right, top left, top left, lower left. But it's wise to go down all of the stairs because you get items there. In most of the stones anyway. There's three, usually three options and in one of the ones always blank. In one of them stones is an item. Here's a fire stone which is an evolutionary item. It will evolve, um, I believe, Eevee into Flareon and Growlithe into Arcanine and a couple more. I don't think he battles you. I hope not. Alright. So. It's really important that we get all the items that are hidden in here. Including like the ones I'm doing right now. And these. This floor doesn't have an item at all. Okay. Oh no there's a battle here. I am going to speed this up real quick. Okay, so after we get rid of that guy, the battle, here's another item, here's a water stone. Uh, it will evolve uh, Eevee into Vaporeon and a couple more which I don't remember because of my really crappy memory. <laughs> okay, so moving on to the depths of Sal Salacion Ruins. And there's only one, and I think, no, we didn't, never mind, we didn't miss it. Throw up another repel, 
we can finally use up all our normal repels and here we get the thunderstone this thing will evolve our EV into the Pokemon you're about to see right now so yeah we're finally evolving Eevee also known as Zeus and if you didn't guess it already uh, it's Jolteon yes all right so we have one of our Pokemon fully evolved which is a great thing so yeah Jolteon um, it's a really good electric type in my opinion it's really fast really speedy and it's fun it's fun having it and its ability changes to Wolt Absorb so if it gets hit by an electric type move it heals itself so it's a really good Pokemon I like it I've never used it before I don't think I have but I think we went the wrong way. We got lost in the Solacion ruins. Ooh. I think it's this way. Wow, we are horribly lost, aren't we? Here? No, this is the way we came from. Wow. Okay. Get it together, right? And I think we are at the bottom. Yes, we are here. <laughs> okay, so first you can find a nugget, which um, you can uh, sell. It's only for the purpose of selling for 5,000 pocket dollars. That's really good. Here you get the HMO5 defog if the area is in fog. And if you use it, it just, as the move said, it just you defogs the whole area so you can see clearly. Here you can grab a mine plate, which uh, is one of those special plates that I talked about. Um, for a really special Pokemon called Arceus and also raises um, psychic type moves which is really good here friends friendship all life I have no idea I'll probably flash it up on the screen because I really can't read it right now but I'll flash up the what it actually says on the screen right now or we can just, you know, quickly use our newly uh, uh, off screen. I bought one of these, so escape rope time. Okay, so uh, this is it for now. Next time in Pokemon Platinum, we'll be exploring what's remaining of Salacian Town, the couple items and all that stuff. And. Yeah, we'll move on to the next route because there's not much notes to do here because there's no gym or anything. So, see you next time, guys. Peace out.